technology consists of the knowledge, tools, and techniques used to transform inputs, raw materials, and information into outputs, products, and services. A technology cycle begins with the birth of a new technology and ends when that technology reaches its limits or dies and is replaced by a newer, substantially better technology. Technology cycles occurred when air conditioners supplanted fans, when Henry Ford's Model T replaced horse-drawn carriages, and when planes replaced trains as means of cross-country travel, and so on. From the invention of the printing press to the rapid advance of the internet, studies of hundreds of technological innovations have shown that nearly all technology cycles follow the typical S-curve pattern of innovation shown here. Early in a technology cycle, there's still much to learn, so progress is slow as depicted by the first point in the S-curve. The flat slope indicates that increased effort in terms of money or research and development brings only small improvements in technological performance. Fortunately, as new technology matures, researchers figure out how to get better performance from it. This is represented by point B in the S-curve. The steeper slope indicates that small amounts of effort will result in significant increases to performance. After technology has reached its limits at the top of the S-curve, significant improvements in performance usually come from radical new designs or new performance-enhancing materials. Eventually, however, the new technology will replace the old technology. What then happens is the old technology cycle will be complete and a new one will have started.